Josie, don't now! Then keep your tongue off of me! And then in the spring, something happened. Yes, I remember now. The family white hope. <laughs> Getting a swell head lately. About nothing! About a few poems in a Hicktown newspaper. I used to write better stuff in a lit magazine in college. You better wise up. You're setting no rivers on fire. You let Hicktown boobs flatter you with bunk about your future. Don't forget it. That goes for Sweeney. You know I don't mean it. <laughs> I have a little present for you over your fare. I stole it from his little green bag. <laughs> I want to be wild when he finds out. Oh, but I can handle him. You can. You're the only one who could, Josie. And you have a good heart, but I don't like taking stolen money. Don't be a bigger jackass than Yard Yard. Tell your conscience it's a bit of the earnings he's never given you. That's true, Josie. It's rightfully mine. <laughs> Well, hurry now, so you won't miss the trolley. And don't forget to get off at Bridgeport. Okay. And give my love to Thomas and John. <laughs> no, they haven't written me in years. God, give them a boot in the tail for me. Oh, that's fine language from a woman. You've got a tongue as dirty as the old man's. Don't start lecturing me on temperance, or you'll never go. You're as bad as he is. Almost. What's the use? What's the use of me talking? What's the use of anything? Oh, man. You mustn't think that for a second. You mustn't think all the other bad things about me you want to and I won't kick. Because you've got a right to. But not that. I couldn't bear it. It'd be just too much to know you'd be going away where I'd never seen you again thinking that about me. The second flood come roaring and know it, be tipped overboard. The sun would fall from the sky like a white fig, and the devil perform miracles, and God be tipped back for your judgment seat. And you? Oh. Did he pass? I should say not. I should certainly say not. Jim, I knew it! I knew you couldn't pass! Oh, Jim, I'm so glad! There! I told you I'd get the laugh! There! Who's got the laugh now? Jim, you white devil woman, you devil! Jim! No, no, Jim, it's alright. It's dead. You see, I killed it. I killed it, Jim, because if you would have passed and it would have lived in you, and then it would have come after me, but I'd killed it, Jim, and... Like a veil of things as they seem drawn back by an unseen hand. And for a second you see, and seeing the secret, you are the secret. For a second there's meaning. And then the hand lets the veil fall. And you are alone, lost in the fog again. And you stumble on toward nowhere for no good reason. It was a great mistake by being born a man. I would have been much more successful as a seagull or a fish. As it is, I will always be a stranger who never feels at home, who does not really want, and is not really wanted, who can never belong. I must always be a little in love with death. 